Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Brooke, and today I wanted to share with you some things that I picked up at my local dollar store. Quite a few of you liked my last Dollar Tree video, and some of you have been requesting them, and I never remember to film after I come home from the Dollar Tree, but this time I did remember. So, figured now would be the perfect time to film another Dollar Tree haul. I love watching other people's Dollar Tree hauls just because you can find some pretty cool things at your local dollar store, even name brand stuff. Um, so starting out is a name brand item and it's something that I have on my lips. It's from Milani and it's just a lip gloss. It doesn't have a color, it's like a nude shade. But I picked this up, I think I purchased this probably two or three times. It smells like vanilla and it just, I love the smell of it feels really good on the lips. It doesn't feel sticky. It feels a little moisturizing, but it just, I don't know, it makes the lips feel really good and it's just a, kind of like a mauve nude shade. And that's what the packaging looks like. Again, I don't think there was anything on the packaging. I could be wrong because I put this on my lips and I threw it away. Um, but on it, the packaging itself, it just says lip gloss. So, um, that is a Milani nude lip gloss that I love. Smells great, feels great. For a dollar, can't beat it. No. Next item I picked up. I only got one of these. I wish I would have gotten more. I'm probably going to go back and get more. But it is a scarf hanger, which is pretty cool. You just drape your scarfs over it. It's kind of like a felt hanger. It's pretty, like, nicely made, too, for a dollar. I was really shocked. So I got that. Always nice to have something like this. You could even use this for, like, your belts, too. Or necklaces. I mean, I'm sure there's all kinds of things you could use this for. And I don't wash my hair every day because I have long hair. I don't want to dry it out, and it's just healthier for your hair not to wash it every day. Plus, I have dry skin, so I don't have to. But anyways, that's besides the point. So I picked up a little shower cap, and I thought this one was really cute with all the lips on it. Just to throw my hair in. Or if I do a hair mask, this would be nice for it. But basically, I got this so my hair doesn't get wet when I shower. So the dollar store is now carrying detangler brushes, which these can be quite pricey. Um, I haven't used this or tried it out yet, so I'll have to let you guys know how I like it. But I figured for a dollar it was worth the shot and trying it. So that's what it looks like. They had quite a few colors, but I picked the pink, obviously, because I love pink. But um, I thought that was pretty cool that they're carrying these. So I'm going to give that a try. And then for eyeliner, I actually have this eyeliner on my eyes today. Let's see. I'll zoom you guys in so you can see, but so it's a liquid liner, but as you can see, it dries to a matte finish and it's very black. So I always pick up one whenever I go to the dollar store just so I can have backups because I love this liner and it's so cheap. Um, it's by LA Colors and like I said, it's their liquid liner and I just get the color black and this is what the packaging looks like. I picked up two this time. Um, this is what they look like. And that's, that's what the brush tip looks like. It kind of reminds me of the NI, NI, kind of reminds me of the NYC liquid liner, but this one is a little bit smaller, the brush is. But for a dollar, you cannot beat it. So another thing from LA Colors that I picked up is their loose eyeshadow pigment. And I've gotten one before and it was in the color Snow or Snow White. And it's beautiful for like an inner eye highlight or I've even used it on my face um, or an eyeshadow. It's really pretty. So I picked up this one in Sunshine. It's a beautiful gold color. I want to try it as not only eyeshadow, but even as a highlight maybe. So I just opened it. It's what, it comes in like a little jar thing. It has a little brush. Try. Ooh, 
that's pretty. Yeah, I definitely wouldn't be using this as a highlight, but I would definitely use it as an eyeshadow. It's beautiful. It's a really pretty gold with a little bit of glitter in it. Hopefully you guys can see it and it's picking up. It's a really beautiful shimmery gold. I love that. That is only a dollar, guys. So that's what they look like. And they come in a package like that. And they have all kinds of colors, pinks and purples. I'll probably get more since I know that I like these. But I think they're really pretty and pigmented for a dollar. You just... I say that all the time. For a dollar, you can't beat it. But you really can. So pick that up. And then I am always, always losing my hair ties. So I picked up some more hair ties and I like these ones. They are like elastic with, um, there's like no metal on them. So they're not going to break your hair. They're better on your hair than those. And they have grips on them, rubber grips. So your hair is not going to slip out of them. And it will stay real tight in your hair. That's why I like these. And so I picked another pack of those up and for like days I don't want to do my hair or I'm cleaning or just to get my hair on my face when I'm doing my makeup I picked up some hair clips I got these hair clips to put all my hair up with or these smaller ones to put up put them like halfway up and if you have long hair these kind of things come in easy especially when you're trying to get ready or even when you're trying to do your hair put half of it up and curl it or there's just so many uses for these if you have long hair you should definitely invest in some clips especially if they're only a dollar and they also have a bunch of little ones too um, if you have shorter hair thinner hair or for your little girl so that's all I got from this haul if you guys want me to do more of these videos I will um, I go to my local dollar store quite a bit at least once a month um, but I usually forget to film these. But if you guys want me to continue doing these hauls, I will. And I'll try to keep it like 10 items or so. I don't want to do like a video with 30 items and bore you guys. So yeah, if you guys are interested in me doing more videos and what kind of items. If you're more into the beauty items, household, cooking, or whatnot, <laughs> craft stuff, let me know. That way I can gear my hauls towards you guys. Um, but yeah, if you guys enjoyed this, please let me know in the comments down below or give me a thumbs up. Uh, as always, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys next week. Take care and God bless.